ACPS opened a brand new school in West Louisville just days before class starts. WDRB's Darby Bean takes us through Perry Elementary and shows us the other projects the district is still working on. There's collaboration spaces, brand new classrooms, and an entirely new building. Perry Elementary is getting ready to welcome more than 600 students. All right, are you all ready? A celebration made official with the cutting of a ribbon. Two, three. Perry Elementary School in Louisville's West End, connected to the YMCA at 18th and Broadway, will open its doors for the first time in just a few days. I can't say enough about what a big day this is for JCPS. It's all part of a JCPS plan to build nearly two dozen schools within a decade. Across town in the city's East End, Echo Trail Middle School will also open this fall. And here, Perry Elementary students are excited for these new experiences. We have a cool gym, it's connected to the YMCA, um, and it's like cool because like we have a new classroom. It won't only share a gym with the Y, but also a swimming pool and access to meeting spaces, getting the community connected with Perry. I'm loving it that my kids get to see this and experience this and get all the opportunities that come with it. The former Wheatley Elementary building is also temporarily transforming this year into Hudson Middle School, allowing parents in West Louisville to choose a neighborhood school for their students instead of going to another part of town. JCPS has plans to create an entirely new building for Hudson students in the future and will announce its permanent home in the coming months. According to the district, at least six other schools are on the list to start new construction by 2026. JCPS students, like those here at Perry, are dreaming big with a brand new place to call their own. I want to be a doctor, policeman, and a teacher, and a lunch lady. There's still a few things to finish up here at Perry Elementary, but the district says it should all be ready by the first day of school. Reporting with photojournalist Dave White, Darby Bean, WDRB News.